It's Audi from GameStorm. Today I'm going to show you how to get 5.1 surround sound and use your HDMI on your 360. All you need for this is some electrical tape, little tiny screwdriver, your component in an AV cable, and an HDMI and a TV. All that kind of stuff. Anyways, what you want to do? Um, I'm already taking mine off, as you can see. You just take this little plastic stuff off. It's so easy. Um, goes on. It's like this, you know. All you do, get the little screwdriver, and you put it in right here. Pop this part up. And then I used a butter knife. Um, like this. Go around the sides, pull it up, go on the bottom, pull it up, it all comes off. And then the little part where it switches from HD and SD, you know, I just put that inside there, clip back together, and then get some tape and just tape the holes so the little thing doesn't come out. That's all I did. Oh no, it came out. <laughs> and see, that's why you tape it. So you don't lose it. Just like that. Then all you want to do is, like, it has some exposed wiring type stuff right here. That's what the electrical tape's for. Just tape that up, and if you notice, it's all silvery and metal. The switcher for SD and HD is right here. It's a little black switcher. Um, just make sure you know which one's which. I mean, it'll tell you on the 360 if it's HD or not. Um, then all you do is get your uh, optical cable, like so. Plug it in, if I can figure out which way it goes. Plug it in like that. It's in there. Then all you gotta do... Plug that into your 360, and now you've actually got room to plug in your HDMI too, because with the plastic, that's the whole reason we took it off, the plastic is too big. It covers up this hole. So now you do is get your HDMI. Voila. 5.1 and HDMI. Right there. That's how easy it is. Now I'm going to show you how to set it up on the actual Xbox. Alright, so I just plugged in all the stuff. I'm fixing to turn on my Xbox and show you what to do. Just turn it on. I'll turn on my monitor so you can see. Okay. And the best part about this, with the HDMI being plugged in, is you get the best quality video. And because HDMI has audio with it, it's going to put audio on your monitor or TV, whatever you're using, along with the surround sound 5.1 using the optical. Okay. I'm going to zoom in here really quick so you can see what I'm doing. Okay. You're going to go over to the system settings. Go into console settings and display. And if you notice on the right there, it says 1080p widescreen HDMI plus audio. It's, so it automatically recognizes the HDMI as the main video source. It overrides the component or the composite. So you don't even have to mess with this. All you got to do is just, you know, pick what resolution you want. Mine's 1080p. So there you go. You're good to go there. Now all you do is go to audio, digital output, which we, what we're messing with is 5.1 digital. And then either you're going to pick 5.1 or 5.1 with WMA Pro, just don't pick stereo, and you're good to go. So, try on your surround sound, and you'll be gaming like a pro. Remember to tune in to GameStorm for more useful tutorials, reviews, and everything gaming. This is Audi from GameStorm, signing out.